So we've got fighting tiny bed bugs inside the chair. Oh my God. Look at that. Has become big business for Columbus, Ohio exterminator Lonnie Alonso, who has no idea why his state is under siege. About 80 to 90 percent of the phone calls we get every single day are related to bed bugs. Nationally, since 2006, the money spent eradicating bed bugs has more than doubled, topping $250 million. New York City leads the misery index, where even couples like the Krauses living in upscale apartments are finding themselves infested. I woke up and found that I had a couple bites on me. That's when I was like, I'm pretty sure this is leading to bed bugs. America is suddenly crawling with these critters because they've developed a resistance to most pesticides. Experts say there is an effective weapon, a chemical called Propoxer, that keeps killing for up to five weeks. But the EPA says that could be dangerous to children, and the government recently ruled no more can be manufactured for inside use. As of a week and a half ago, I ordered the last 170 cases that uh, through my supplier was able to find. But no state is tackling this plague as aggressively as Ohio. It's even petitioned the EPA for permission to continue using the pesticide Propoxer indoors as its last best option. But even as they await approval, time and stores of the toxin are running out. The other options um, of newer technologies, newer chemicals that hopefully will come down the pike those things will take a long time. We need short-term solutions. Bed bugs can live up to a year. Each female can give birth to as many as 500. Alonzo says, unlike roaches or ants, these insects feast on you, which is why they settle on beds, couches, and recliners. Columbus grandmother Dolores Stewart has been fighting the pests for nearly a year. I don't want to go to bed. I don't want them crawling all over me. The EPA is standing firm on its ban of Propoxer indoors, but offers these suggestions. Seal cracks and crevices along baseboards. Remove clutter. Use a special mattress cover. Dry clothing and sheets at high temperatures. Don't let them get out of control, because once you let them get out of control, you can't handle them. Scientists say the perfect parasite never kills its host. But as millions of Americans have found out, it can sure drive them crazy. Cynthia Bowers, CBS News, Columbus, Ohio.